Hi, I'm Miss Dara and I'm from the Rogers Public Library and today we're doing Creative Coders and it's our last Creative Coders of the summer. But that's okay, we'll do again another Creative Coders or maybe we can do another program like this again. So today we are going to talk about loops. So we've talked about um, a lot of different things like algorithms and if-then statements and if-else statements and a lot of different things about coding, but today we're going to talk about loops. So a loop is a um, like something that repeats. So if you plan out an algorithm, then you can have a repeat and make a loop. So today we are going to um, try this and see how it works. So today we're going to do a dance party. Does anybody like to dance? I mean, that's a lot of fun, right? So we are going to try some different steps and see how we can um, make our instructions for our computers easier by using loops. So here we go. Today we're gonna try this thing here and it says we're gonna clap, 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 put our hands behind our head, put it on our waist, behind our head, our waist, Clap, 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 left up, right up, left up, right up, clap, 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 and laugh. So let's try it. So you guys can do it with me. So we're going to clap, 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 behind our heads, at our waist, behind our heads, at our waist, clap, 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 left up, right up, left up, right up, clap, 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 laugh. <laughs> so that is one loop. So if we did that over and over and over and over, if we didn't make a loop in our code, then we would have to type that out and put each one of those steps in because computers don't do things unless we tell them exactly what to do. So if we want to make our code shorter, we can just do a loop since we're going to be repeating the same thing over and over and over again. So here, if we do since we are doing in this one a clap 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 do you think we could make that any shorter we could probably just put clap and make it loop that so it'll do it three times and then we can do if there's a loop here we do behind the head waist behind the head waist i bet we could just do this once and make it repeat that's another loop then we have our same loop again left up right up left up right up that's another loop we can repeat. And then our claps again, and then this is the single one. So see, we can make our codes a whole lot shorter than this, even in this, can't we? Because it's a loop. So if you guys um, want to learn more about loops, there's all kinds of games where you can learn about loops on code.org. And so go to code.org and find, there's all kinds of coding games and all kinds of things that you can do to learn more about coding and learn more about loops. So today I'm gonna to show you another robot that we have here at the library. We have three of these here. This is one that's good for little bitty kids, but older kids can use it too. This is called a Coda Pillar. So let me turn him on so that you can hear him. It says hello. And so he has a button here. And so to code him, he has little pieces, like this is a straight, and he has a sound and then we have turning things so we can turn one way or turn the other way and we can do straights so he comes with these two little pads so you can make him go or you can make him stop and it's just like you can put it down and make him go from place to place and you could set up obstacle courses with him but let's see how he does here and maybe we can do it and not let him fall off okay i'm gonna set it can you see okay so here we go let's see he makes a lot of noise Back. Let me 
turns. And he doesn't like to fall off. He knew that he fell off and his eyes turn red because he gets mad when he falls off of things. So this is the Coda Pillar. If you're interested in seeing it, we have it here at the library. Let me turn him off because he's really loud. So if you want to see him, we have him here at the library and you can ask us about him to see him. So we'll see you next time and um, have a great day. Bye-bye.